hello my lovely welcome back to my channel this is always west kitchen it is always so good to have you here today i'm taking you through how i make this popular Ghanaian street food awache you are simply going to love it so without wasting too much time let's get in and start cooking i've got my watcher leaves here i'm going to give it a thorough wash inside and out just to make sure that any hidden thing in there has been removed this special watcher recipe i'm going to share with you was passed on to me by my mom's best friend it has become one of my favorite recipes you're going to just love it she told me mommy if you want the best watch just make sure you measure your beans and rice correctly and she is right i'm going to take you through that shortly once it has been cleaned thoroughly i'm going to put it in my cooking pot and to that i'm going to add hot boiled water to it and cover it this process ensures the leaves are softened up and thereby allowing its beautiful color to seep through the hot water. For that perfect rice and beans proportion, I am going for four cups of beans. You can of course cook any number of cups that you want. Even if you are not using a cup to measure this, just make a mental measurement as it will help you to know how much rice to add. So once that is done, I'm going to go ahead and take any bad ones out, you know, all the discolored ones, all the rotten ones, whatever foreign material in there, I'm going to quickly get them out and give it a good wash. These luckily have no stones in them, neither does it have that bees beetles, you know, do you remember? <laughs> Nevertheless, please go ahead and still wash your beans. The beans are now washed nicely. So now we'll go over and check our soaked leaves. As you can see, the color is popping nicely as well. Yes, so I'll just go ahead and pour all the beans in and then I'll quickly just stir it, you know, just to make sure that the beans are underneath so it can cook quickly. And I have added a little bit more water and it is ready to be cooked. Moving on to the rice, for any quantity of cups of beans you use, be sure to go one less for the rice. So for instance, I'm going for three cups of rice to go with the four cups of beans that we cooked. And even if you are not using a cup to measure, just make sure that your beans is certainly slightly more than the rice. As you can see I have taken all the leaves from it at this stage and the beans has cooked perfectly it isn't too soft or hard it still got some sort of texture to it in Ghana as you know rice is more expensive than beans so the watch sellers would rather use more beans as opposed to more rice it's for seasoning we'll be going for all purpose seasoning yes it is all purpose after all it works magic with watch it and i'm using this one okay and i've also added some onion powder yes lovely if you haven't tried this before please give this a go you would love it and that was followed by some if you are new to my channel i hope you like it in here to subscribe yes my dear go ahead and subscribe with your notification bell on to receive all future uploads i also scooped a spoonful and a half of coconut oil as well it just looks so beautiful even before it cooks and it smells so so lovely as well the liquid should be on the same level as the rice and beans to get you that perfect texture i'm going to add two bay leaves as well because bay leaves dear any rice echo come on <laughs> you can also rinse off the leaves and freeze it for later use and now let's go and check how the awache is doing wow look look at this ah adiena ayekamas 
the color, the texture, the beans and rice proportion, everything is looking just so fine. And the aroma is just incredible. The onions, all purple seasoning, the bay leaves and the coconut oil, they've created this wonderful aroma in my kitchen here right now and I'm just love. I am happy with this and now my baby is more being our shake. And no, and yet ding 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 and also so and yet too soft. Who's that watching the oh more and the kakra and money could you if you like what you are seeing right now please hurry and bring your plate because the awache party is just about to begin. <laughs> if you haven't watched my upload for last week where we prepared this delicious awache stew, please check it down below the description box and it will go wonderfully with this awache and enjoy. Thank you, thank you for watching and I kindly ask that you leave a like on the page. Please like this video and I see you next time with another delicious meal. Until then, take care and stay blessed. Bye-bye.